Simmers is Passions and welcome to my channel and part six of Roaring Heights. Okay. Um so Marilyn woke up today. She's raking the leaves because today is the first day of fall. She's raking them leaves and um I think I send Joe to work on the engine of this car because you know, even though we don't need the money, but it's kind of like a hobby, I guess. And they want to, you know, I guess that's, uh, that's going to be his thing. You know, working on cars and, you know, and stuff like that. Since he ain't doing, um, uh, baseball anymore. Alright. Well, he kind of is doing baseball, you know, he's. It's just we haven't been really focusing on his career lately. So, yeah. Of course, Marilyn, she's unemployed because she decided she know, you know, she wants to have a family. And when she's ready, I guess she'll go back to, to, to acting and stuff. But right now, all she wants to do is just enjoy her pregnancy and have a beautiful, healthy baby. And that's a... And that... I was just remembering. She needs to read these books because it's something that she wants to do. She wants a girl. So we need to get her to buy some watermelons at the supermarket and stuff her little face with watermelons. Here it is. Let's go to the Deco Grocery. Um, shop for groceries right here. So she's going to do that. All that happens. Yes. I don't know who's calling us. Who's calling us? Somebody's calling us, but we are going to ignore the call. No, he's not going to chat with nobody. Oh, uh, look at her, her cute little waddle. She looks so adorable. And I think she's going to be due soon. So the watermelon thing might not work. Because I forgot. Yeah. Before she wasn't showing as much. But now she is. So we can try. You know. But. Yeah, it might not work. I guess maybe for her next pregnancy. Because she wants to have five kids. So we gave her and Joe the fertility trait. I mean treatment. So when she gives birth to this baby, we're gonna tr we're gonna go jump right on that wagon again and get her pregnant right away because this is gonna be a short series. So we need to get her um, pregnant. Let's go into produce and let's get her some watermelon. Hopefully, if it doesn't work for this pregnancy, I'm sure it'll definitely work for the next one. Alrighty. Okay, so we're going to get her about, you know, now oh, she's going to eat all of them, but. Uh, just took shopping. Okay, going to enjoy this. Okay. Where are you going, mister? No, you don't need to do that. Um, I want you to. Okay, you worked on the engine, so now work on the body. You want to who with wifey, huh? Well, don't do it. Alright, so while you're working on the body. Yeah, so like I was saying, so we're definitely going to get her to eat watermelons. Hopefully it'll work, but it might not work since her pregnancy is already advanced. Um, oh, okay, so she's reading her pregnancy books at wherever she's at right now. She was supposed to come home, but that's okay, I guess. Um, why are you reading your book there? No. Come home and read the book at home. Don't stand there. Right? You can read the book on your, when you're home. All right. So, yeah. Um, 
Okay, so he's working on that. Alrighty now. Well, I'm excited to see the baby. I'm excited to know what she's having. Oh, I wish there was a way where you can go to the hospital and she can see the doctor and and stuff like prenatal care type thing and then you're able to find out what you're having and stuff. It's that would be so cool if there was like something like that added in the Sims 4 sometime in the future. That would be such an awesome thing. Alrighty. Now that she's home we're going to get her to eat a watermelon and then she can I don't know which one she was reading. Okay, I guess she didn't finish reading it. Alright. So we're going to have her read both books. And uh, we'll have... Okay, so he's feeling good. Why don't we have you reading up on these books? Yeah, we'll do that. Both of you. Read up on your on your pregnancy books, you know, get you guys prepared since the baby's coming soon. Cause, you know. And then uh we can probably you know he wants to take her out on a date. Maybe we can go out for dinner. And uh he wants to go to Paris. She definitely wants to go to Egypt. And I guess that's just going to have to happen when the baby's here, I guess. Okay, so she's stuffed. She's not hungry right now. But definitely her back is aching. So after they finish reading the books, I guess you can give her a little massage and, and stuff. You want to join the what? The law enforcement career? I don't think so. No, you don't need to do none of that. Um, who's calling you, by the way? We don't care. We will ignore it. Um, is not. Okay. All right. Let me just forward this a bit, because we're literally not gonna sit here watching the maid. All right, so when they finish reading their books, we'll be back. Oh my God, oh my God. They were reading the books. They didn't get to finish reading them. They were almost done. Um, but guess what? Marilyn's having the baby. The baby's coming. Ah! Okay, I'm dying to know what she's having. I hope she has that little girl she wants. But oh well. I guess she'll have it in the next pregnancy, I guess. And then she's thinking of going to Egypt. Girl, you're about to have a baby. Look at her face. Look at him. Listen, you need to take her to the hospital. Yes, take to the hospital. Come on. Baby's coming. Come on. Take to the hospital. Relax. Everything's going to be fine. Everything's going to be just fine. Look at him just leaving way ahead of her. That never fails. That just never fails. All right. Um... We'll do that instead. Since we have them. Alrighty. <laughs> She's so cute when she waddles. Alright. That's right. You better get the car ready because she's coming. Everything's going to be fine. Everything is going to just be fine. Okay, where is the car? Oh, she's, oh, okay. She's going to drive herself to the hospital. Okay. <laughs> Marilyn, it was supposed to be Joe driving you. <laughs> okay. Alrighty. So this is exciting. Oh my gosh, she's going to have her baby. And we're going to get to see uh, what she's going to have, I hope. I I'm sure. Why are you going through them bushes, girl? Oh, well then. Yeah. 
I don't think the fertility treatment took right away and that watermelon thing I don't think it did because we started basically doing this at the end of her pregnancy and if she happens to have a baby girl that's because she happens to have it it wasn't because of the, pregnant, the watermelon girl you were at the hospital just Marilyn come on go inside the hospital you're there there we go. There you go. Great. Alrighty. So let's see what they're gonna have. This is so exciting. I usually done this so many times. Oh my gosh, she got to have her little girl. Oh my god. Okay. I know I had asked you guys to give me, you know, 50s baby girl names and stuff. And one of the most uh, famous 50s name that happens to keep uh, tugging at me is Rose. So we are going to call our baby girl Rose. Yes, Rose DiMaggio. Oh, her little flower is born. Oh. Okay, so we're going to choose her trait. First, let's randomize it. Let's see. Ooh, no. Uh, no. Oh, God. Why is she getting these horrible traits? Artistic and disciplined. You know what? That's, those are good traits. Those are very good traits. So we'll keep those traits. Oh, she's too cute for herself. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, we have twins! I didn't think the fertility treatment was gonna take like that. Oh my god. Okay, twins. Uh, Rose. Um. Oh wow. Um Oh crap. I wasn't expecting I wanted twins, but I wasn't expecting it. You know, I didn't think it was going to take. Okay. Uh All right. Rose and um I want them to have our names cuz you know, Rose um Rose and uh Rosalie. Um no. Rose and Ro oh my god Rose and Riley Rose and Riley yep Rose and Riley okay all right um so they want artistic and disciplined okay discipline and excitable I like that. They share a trait because they're twins, so they're both disciplined. I like that. I like that. Alrighty. Perfect. Oh, I'm so excited. This is such an awesome part. Oh, I really wasn't ex What? Incarnations. Wait a minute here. Triplets? You're kidding me. I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I've never had triplets playing The Sims 3. Never. I've always had twins. Never triplets. Oh my god, this is so exciting. And then my alarm is telling me that my time is up. Wow. What a perfect ending to this part. Oh, oh my god, I'm so <laughs> Oh wow. I wish you could see my face. I'm elated. Smile from ear to ear. I'm so excited. I never had triplets. Wow. Okay. Ah, uh, a boy. Um, oh my God. Well, his father's name is Joe. And um, and mother's name is Marilyn. Um. Okay, you know what? We'll name him Michael. Yes. Oh, Rose, Riley, and Michael. Oh, this so cute girl. Triplets? Wow. 
Wow. Okay, they're all going to have the, the discipline trait. I like that. I really do. All right. Ugh, I'm going to have to get it back. Actually, I like that. Brave and disciplined. I like that. Awesome. There we go. Wow, this is just amazing. Oh. Girl. <laughs> oh. This is amazing. I, I can't. Look at her. Oh, with her little baby carrier. Oh, girl. Yeah, you better run because it's raining. Okay, where are my babies? Wait. She's holding all of them in there? Wow. <laughs> wow, this is amazing. <laughs> yeah, you better be excited and elated. <laughs> Just had trippers. He'll never forget the moment his life changed forever oh. by adding three babies to the household. Wow. Oh, wow. Shots. Great. Uh, you need to go home, buddy. Cause she's she left. She is gone. She's like, uh uh. I'm not getting my babies wet. She left you behind. <laughs> oh my god. Oh wow, it's so amazing. Look at her running inside the house. She don't want her babies getting wet or sick. Awesome. What an awesome night. Great. Now hopefully, in the next pregnancy, we won't have triplets. Because all you need is two, so twins will be nice. <laughs> Wow. And that's because I'm thinking that's because he has the fertility trait as well. That's what I'm thinking. And that's the reason why she got the triplets. All right. So we were only prepared for one crib. So, uh, okay, guys. So what I'm going to do is I am going to... Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to end this part right here and I'm going to do a little makeover in their nursery and stuff. And uh, yeah, so you guys will be seeing everything in the next part and um, hopefully by then the babies have grown into toddlers. Yes. Um, yeah, so in the next parts the baby will be toddlers. And you can finally see their little nursery and stuff like that. So once again, thank you for watching. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Triplets! <laughs> um, if you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't. Comment. And also follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you so much for watching and happy simming. Mm -hmm.